Well, I think to me the most exciting thing is the the opportunity for collaboration. Um, you know, I was I was talking to uh, someone at Global Action Project last night, and one of the things that really was amazing us both about the collection of people in the hive, the collection of organizations, is that it's not just museums, it's not just youth media organizations, it's not just. Um, you know, like digital media, like education organizations. It really is like this collection of really eclectic people and really eclectic institutions and organizations that are doing really interesting cutting edge work. And to be able to step outside of our silos a little bit and learn from one another, that to me is really exciting. I'd say my like high aha moment actually happened before we were even members. It was when uh, we first sat down with our friends at Institute of Play to talk about a collaboration. And, uh, you know, just bouncing off of Bouncing ideas off of them, I realized, you know, here are some really smart people and they have expertise that can really sort of complement what we're doing really well. And, you know, it was sitting with them that I realized, oh, well, that's what this is really all about, this, this chance to, to learn from people who have great experience and great ideas and um, to share what we're doing with them. So far, um, being, being part of the Hive has been a really great opportunity as a, at the organizational level because there are all these organizations all over the city working with young people and doing it in somewhat different ways. Some of the stuff we do a lot is the same, but it's really interesting to go to all these different organizations, talk to different people from it, and find out how they're doing what they're doing, and taking little bits and pieces of that and adding it to our own organization, or our own planning, or how we recruit, or how we work with parents, just learning all the different ways that people can work with young people and being able to pick from that to help make your organization stronger is, I think, one of the biggest plus it's for an organization in, a, in the Hive Network. All right, so one of my favorite Hive moments was one of my first Hive moments. It was longer than a moment, it was two days, and we took um, young people from Dream Yard Prep and um, young people from The Point to the Maker Fair. They were all part of a program together in the summer, and the culminating event was to say, go to the Maker Fair and show off the apps that they worked really hard on. Um, so they got to run activities there and work with little kids. They got to run around and see all the cool stuff. Um, they got to show off their apps, and they actually won a, a blue ribbon. But what was awesome was to see all the kids wearing high t-shirts, having fun and learning new things, learning how to solder, um, and just to be a part of that and to, to also learn stuff myself through doing that and to meet a bunch of new kids because I was in the dream yard was really the best, best thing so far from, from the high. I think the greatest value in being a member of the Hive is twofold. Um, for those of us who are educators and designers and makers and practitioners, it gives us a sense of community. We have other people who are working in the same field that we are. We can play test with them, can think with them, we can just do design challenges and compare problems and then then it also gives us this great ability to help the kids that we're working with. So we can tell them about new programs, we can tell them about other places, we can also really help carve the kind of pathways and trajectories that the kids themselves will be taking. So if we notice a particular skill or we notice a particular area of interest, then we're really able to move to help the kids move in that direction because we have these connections with other colleagues and with other organizations that have um, similar interests or can can help kids find activities and, and events that are interesting. I think um, building, continuing to build on the relationships, because we've already had a, a good good way of connecting with organizations, but so when a funding opportunity or a new possibility comes up, sometimes we don't have to feel alone or that we're starting from scratch. I know I have a network of colleagues that I could, either they've done a similar project or they'll brainstorm ideas with me or maybe even be a partner on it. So it really helps, helps us build our capacity. The Hive, representing the Busy Bees buzzing. Probably more organizations than a dozen coming together, moving the minds, energy so combined so that we can intertwine and move forward rather than rewind all of the different factors, sections, sectors, ways that we perfect our learning, living, life, loving community experience. For me, the Hive is a breeding ground, a place where we can ferment our ideas and bring them out into the universe in seconds, not days or years.